All right, everybody, we are talking to a letter carrier now. This is the very lovely Jacqueline Tykeson Coulter. She was with the National Association of Letter Carriers, who is here to represent that organization because the food drive is coming back. So, half a day. Good to have you here. Thank you. Yes, our food drive is uh, May 13th. Uh, you'll get flyers in your mail. You put your food out wherever you receive your mail. So, if you have a neighborhood box, you'll set it out there. We'll pick it up. If you have a mailbox, we'll pick it up from there. If you don't receive mail, because there's a lot of places in Guam that don't receive mail, you can drop it off at one of the local post offices. So Bear God is open on Saturday, and also the Ganya post office is open on Saturday. And that is something that you, you and your colleagues never want to hear, that we didn't receive our mail. So you guys are working really extra hard <laughs> to make sure that these get out. Yes, we are. We're working very hard. We love picking up the food. It's our the 20th, 25th annual food drive. And all of the donations go to a local food, the food, local food drives here in Guam. Mm -hmm. And I know this is something that the National Association of Letter Carriers very, very passionate about. We've talked to many of you over the years, and and this truly is a, it's I don't even want to say labor of love because this is a this is a cause that you are very seriously committed yes, to. Yes, this is my favorite time of year because this is the year I get to help pick up food and make sure that other families get to eat. Mm -hmm. Now, what are you guys doing to? Prepare. I'm sure, obviously, letter carriers, you have to be very, very fit. You have to be in the right you know, <laughs> state of mind and everything. But this is a big undertaking. It is. It's very big. Um, we uh, Same thing we do every day. You'll get your mail, and we'll pick up the food along the way. Nothing changes. No no change in our day for us. It's mm. just extra, you know, it's like you said, the labor of love for us. Mm -hmm. And now I must ask, because, you know, I, I'm old enough to remember that there was so much of a sense of reverence for the postmen and postwomen, right. I should say. Um you know, that whole thing about through sleet, through snow, like nothing is going to hold us back from delivering your mail. We live in much different times <laughs> these days, you know, with logistics are different, technology, drone delivery and everything like that. And yet the commitment to making sure that people get their, their letters, their packages and everything like that, that has not wavered one bit. No, it has not. Every day we make sure that everything that we deliver to the right house every day, all day until we're done. Mm -hmm. um, what's the... Um, the tempo from you and your colleagues now as this event approaches and everything like that. Oh, I know you guys are really high speed. Yeah, we're super excited. We've been preparing, you know, with our flyers and, you know, radio station, putting the word out to everyone that, you know, this is coming. Mm -hmm. And if we would like to help out in any way, in addition to, you know, making donations or anything, are you guys in, in need of any, any elbow grease, shall I say? Like, can we help out in any other way? Uh, they, we have people that separate the food for us, and then it goes, you know, out by donation. We have, you know, clerks and people at the post office that separate the food. All we need is just the food donations. Okay, very Where, cool. Wherever. Well, let, let me ask then, because um, what type of food will you be accepting? Because there's, there's going to be some people, can I make you a cake? Can I, you know, barbecue <laughs> a rack of ribs? Or can I ham um, sandwich, maybe? Uh, all non-perishable foods. All right. And no expired food. We can't take expired food either. So canned goods, absolutely okay. Absolutely. Beans, rice. I know... Guam loves rice. Rice, mm -hmm. whatever you have that you want to donate, we'll, we're accepting it all. Frozen TV dinners, nah. not so much. <laughs> yeah, yeah. E even though us Guamanians, you know, we love to cook, we love to prepare, and everything like that. Yes. So, so stuff that will last. Yes. Okay. So once again, uh, what, when can we expect you guys to be making your rounds? Uh, we're going to hand out flyers this week, and then the food drive actually starts May 13th. If you forget to put your food out, no problem. Set it out then on Monday, and we'll pick it up then also. We'll pick it up all through the week in case I know everybody doesn't always remember the exact date of things. So if you forget, just set it out, and we'll still pick it up. Well, it's an amazing thing you're doing. Thank you so much, Jacqueline. All right. Thank you. All right. All right, everybody. That is going to be it. We'll see you next time.